Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is going to be a organization vlog. Um, I'm currently in my kitchen, so you might have thought it was a baking vlog if you've been on my channel before, but I'm actually going to be organizing this little area which holds like all my family's like mugs, glasses, travel mugs. As you can see, it's like it's sort of organized, but not really. I kind of started a little bit, like I have some stuff out here and like the top, the very top right up there, I kind of organized a little bit, but then I kind of took a break for a minute. I made myself some coffee and like, I really wanted coffee, but then I was like sweating because like, look, now it's even has a memo up here okay I don't know this Keurig is like very weird and the only person who really knows how to fix it is Joey and he's sleeping right now so I spent like so long trying to not that long maybe like five ten minutes before actually like brewed the coffee and by that point I was sweating I've been very sweaty like yesterday and like especially today I woke up at like 8 a.m. And then I ended up falling back asleep at like 10 for a couple hours and woke up like sweating. Then I was okay once I got up, had like some cold water. I came out here, did the dishes, so I like unloaded the dishwasher, reloaded it, all of that. And I was like sweating, but I really wanted coffee, so like that's my day. Um, and I would go out and get like some like cold brew, but I really don't feel like leaving the house today. Like I just... I feel like a mess, I look like a mess, I just don't want to leave the house. So I'm in my pajamas and I am, like I said, going to be reorganizing this cabinet. Okay, so probably 10 minutes later and the whole thing is reorganized. Now I have done this before, but it has been definitely like well over a year since the last time I did this. And I don't know, this thing just gets like so disorganized so quickly. I think because like whenever people run the dishwasher and then unload it, they just kind of like put things up here. And like, it's fine, but like I like things a certain way. And even though this is my mom's house, like she's even been saying like, we need to reorganize this, but she would never take the time to do it just because I know her and she doesn't. But literally, you know how, like, I mean, I don't know if everyone has this in their house, but like, you know, hey, like in my house, we have like a junk drawer where it's literally, even this I cleaned out like a couple months ago because there was so much crap in it. Like it was so much worse than this, like what it is now. But you know, everyone has a junk drawer where they just kind of throw things in and never look at them again. And I feel like this is like, was kind of turning into that. Like there was like this random like stuff, like for my dog, like canine Advantix, like why do we have that? Random medicine from him from like 2017. Medicine like for my mom, more like vitamin whatever's like, I don't know. So I took all that out and I'm like, it needs to just be like cups and mugs. So up here, these are like in this little section, aside from like the Yankee souvenir cups. Um, these are like the mom and dad mugs. Uh, this one, I didn't even know we had this. So this is cool if you're having like a beer or something. And then there's like this one that's from Corpus Christi, which is where my dad went to college. So like, that's cool. Um, we have this mug, which I didn't even know we had. Then we have some glass mugs. We have like a gravy pourer. We have like some portable mugs and um, my fruit ninja cups. Then we have like a couple of these Jack Link like mason jars with the handle that I got. It was like a Valentine's gift package that I got for Joey a couple of years ago. Those came in it. Then these are both Joey's but like this one's Christmas themed and it's August so he's not using that right now. And then there's this black one that comes with a marker that you can like draw on. But I guess once you draw on it, like it doesn't come off. So I got this for Joey probably like two years ago and he hasn't 
putting anything on it yet, so I don't know what's happening with that. Um, then this middle cabinet are like things we use more. So we have like, I'm pretty sure someone stole that from Applebee's, like, because I feel like those come if you get like a dip or something at Applebee's. I don't know who got that. Then these are like for if we have like lobster, like you put the butter in it. Pretty sure my dad stole these from like the lobster house, which is where we get lobster. So great. Then like some mugs, another to go one, a tall glass for your alcoholic beverages. Then the solo cups, then some more mugs back there. Then drink glasses, all of our Disney cups, which there's like four. Um, some wine glasses, another to-go mug, a couple of shot glasses, and then these are like glasses we use every day. So right now there's some here, like that would go here, but they're currently in the dishwasher. So that's where they will go, like actual glasses. And then these are just all mugs that we use like every day. Okay, so to end this video really quick, I kind of wanted to do a little mug review of all of the mugs that are mine and just show you i've kind of started a collection so how many do i have 10 i mean i feel like i have more but i guess not i don't know recently i've like not recently because like this one i got like probably like four years ago um but i don't know i'm really into mugs i just think they're really cool so i kind of if I go somewhere that I don't go to a lot and they have like a really cool mug, I'll get that and it's kind of like a souvenir for me. My dad, this is really weird, but my dad used to buy us like shot glasses as souvenirs when we were like 10 and like obviously couldn't do shots, but like we have so many shot glasses because he's like bought us them as like souvenirs. So that's a thing. But these are mugs that I've gotten myself over the years. So most recently, this isn't going to be in any particular order, this is just the first one. Um, I got this one at Lavender by the Bay, if you saw that a couple videos ago. Um, yeah, and it just says make honey not war and then the whole inside is like yellow. And I just think it's really cute. Then, this one I got like so long ago at like Bed Bath & Beyond, but it was $5 and like this is like a regular size mug and then like this is the size of this mug. It's huge and it was like five bucks. Um, I don't really use it that much because it is so big, but it, it has like all Long Island like things on it and I just think it's really cool and obviously I love Long Island because that's where I live. So love that, like had to get it. And it was $5, which is crazy. Then I'm pretty sure this is my mom's mug. I'm not gonna lie, but we've had this like forever and it's become like my most favorite mug. So I think when I move, I'm gonna try to take it and hopefully she doesn't notice because I don't think she really uses it that much, but I use this like year round and Halloween's my favorite. So this is just so cute. Then, I'm glad I cleaned out the section because I forgot I had gotten this mug that says Happy Hanukkah. I got this probably a couple years ago at Target. Um, it was on sale because Hanukkah had passed and they still had some so it was like five bucks and I was like I need that. Then I have this super cool Game Boy mug and when you actually fill it up to the top with a hot liquid a scene from Super Mario Brothers pops up on the screen and that's on both sides so this is super cool. Then I got this for Joey for Valentine's Day. I think it was like another one of those gift packages um, but he doesn't really use it so I'll use it. Then this little red M&M's mug my mom got me. It was part of like a Valentine's gift package from like probably like three years ago, two or three years ago. And it had like little fun size M&M's candies in it and whatever. So that's cute. So I like to use this mug. And then these three are my Disney mugs that I got when I went in 2018. So this one I got for Joey, but he never really uses it. But I think it's really cute. 
It says Port Orleans Resort Riverside, which is the resort we stayed at last time we went. So I thought that was really cool. Then I got this Epcot mug that I love. I think it's so cool. And then I got this Animal Kingdom mug that I also love and think is so cool. I really thought I got more mugs from Disney the last time I went, but I guess I only got three, but I think they're really cool. So that was the reorganization of the mugs and cups in my house vlog and a little review of my favorite mugs. So I hope you guys like this video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.